Today I have assembled 8 of the baddest no hezi cars for my own hill climb challenge at the Goodwood Festival of Speed, which occurred a few weeks back. We've got 8 different manufacturers, BMW, Audi, Lamborghini, Lexus, Mitsubishi, Nissan, Porsche and Toyota. Horsepower ranging from 674 to 1013. You're probably used to seeing these cars cut up traffic, so let's see how they cut up the hill. Let's get started with run number one. So kicking off the hill climb shootout today is the BMW M4 F82 No Hezi X Bimmer Plug. 925 horsepower, 1,213 newton meters of torque. It's rear wheel drive at about 1,570 kilograms. It does do 0 to 100 in 3.9 seconds. Now the craziest thing, while I was practicing, it is amazing how close it seemed that all the cars were together in terms of time. I didn't actually complete any runs, I stopped before the line. I want this to be a surprise to me as well. Now naturally, before we get started, a little sound check. Bat flames, alright. Here we go. Quick off the line at 900 horsepower, of course. Now the one thing I'll tell you guys, these heavy cars, they need a bit more braking than like a, obviously a Formula One car or something. Like I'm doing over 200 kilometers per hour coming into Malcolm here. Yeah? Most stressful corner in the world. Now obviously if I completely screw up or I feel that it's like such a bad run that it doesn't even count, I'll do it again. You guys won't know about it. There we go. To start us off, 47.693. That's not bad. Well after the BMW is very respectable, 47.7, let's see what the Audi RS6 C7 no hezi spec can do 884 horsepower 1033 newton meters of torque all wheel drive at about 1260 kilograms powered by the 4 liter v8 twin turbo so a little bit lighter but a little bit less on power but before we get started with the run let's do a sound check nasty all right guys and we're Oh, struggling for grip there, ABS. I mean, traction control kicking in. Fifth gear before the first corner. Shorter ratio gearbox here. And down towards the worst corner in the world. Wow, I break guard there. Touching the grass. Past the flint wall. I think it's called the flint wall. Woo! Alright, a little bit of break. A little bit of throttle control and towards the finish. 51.29. Five. That puts us in second place behind the BMW's 47.693. I just didn't feel too comfortable in this car. Moving away from German saloon cars, we have an Italian beast. The Lamborghini Aventador SVJ63 No Hezi Spec. 847 horsepower, 805 newton meters of torque, all wheel drive at 1525 kilograms. Let's see if this Italian monster can take out the BMW. Who's ready for a sound check? Woohoo! Alright, man, I'm kind of worried about this one. I think it might take it. Actually, have like a super super car, yeah. All right, deep focus going into Malcolm. 
brakes feel much better than those other two cars. Probably has to do a lot with weight distribution, if you ask me. Oh, oh, a bit late on the brakes there. Just to the skin of my teeth. Alright, alright, just dab the brake through here. Flat out! No ways! 48.18 BMW hangs on by the skin of its teeth. How on earth? Oh, I guess the BMW had a lot of torque, eh? Woo! Oh yeah, we have a remarkable fusion of style, performance and driving pleasure. The Lexus LC500 Liberty Walk no hezzy spec. Now this has got a 2JZ in it. I am not privy to the information of what engine this comes in, but it seems like it's swapped. 914 horsepower, 897 newton meters of torque, rear wheel drive at 1,305 kilograms. This might be a problem for the other cars. Let's see. <laughs> My goodness. It's angry, all right. <laughs> Nasty. All right, let's do it. I love flames that shoot out of woods. All right, come on, come on, come on. Oh, that's dicey. That was risky. Oh, almost lost it. .59. So with that time, that puts us in third position. The BMW M4 still holding strong. My word, I did not expect this. I wasn't going to tell you guys this, but definitely my favorite car out of the lot. The Mitsubishi Lancer Evolution 9 Voltex. Midnight Evo, no hezzy tuned. 1013 horsepower, 1083 newton meters of torque, all wheel drive at 1325 kilograms, and for the first time, a manual car. Now, this thing is a beast to drive, extremely difficult to tame. The turbo lag is insane. Now, I don't have to explain why. This is going to be your favorite exhaust note. Check this out. Nasty! All right. We do have launch control, we're going to need it. Alright, alright, focus. Smooth! That corner is sharper than you think. Get out! Go, 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 Evo 9, oh my god, this thing is so beautiful. Here we have another brutal car, the Nissan Skyline GTR Halspec No Hezzy Tune. 674 horsepower, 917 newton meters of torque, 1260 kilograms and all wheel drive. So it's not the first time I've driven this car. I actually drove it in my first No Hezzy video. If you guys want to go check that out, definitely do it. Let me play you the sound of my people. Music to my ears, oh my goodness. Anyway, it's time 
to do this. Let's see if I can tame Godzilla. Kinda of off the road there, but I think that's okay. Oh my goodness. That was dicey. Not as smooth as I'd like to be through there. Go, 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 go! Go, freaking words! Now that is a real surprise. I, I'm not kidding. I had no idea this car. I mean, this car's got like 300 horsepower less than all the other ones, and he's no traction control, no ABS. I just posted a 47.23. Wow. We have the Porsche 911993RWB Hull Spec No Hezzy Tuned. Two more cars left that might dethrone that GTR. 842 horsepower. 850 newton meters of torque 1270 kilograms and it's rear wheel drive now i actually made a short with this car on this track and i hit a 47.63 so even if i do that again that's still not dethroning the skyline but uh who knows maybe my driving skill improved probably not before we send the rwb up Man, that is rough. That hurts the ears. All right, it's time. I'll be very gentle with this one. The back likes to break loose. When that turbo kicks in. Uh, I'm losing a lot of precious time here. Forty nine point zero one. Not last place, but nothing too special. The last car on the list and the last opportunity to dethrone that crazy Skyline R thirty two GTR. We have the Toyota GR Supra A ninety High Cade No Hezzy Spec. Eight hundred and thirty two horsepower, one thousand and eighty five newton meters of torque. 1395 kilograms and it's rear wheel drive and this body kit is beautiful before we get started of course oh, oh, i love that crackle and pop i'm sure that's going to translate into a good lap time Just went crazy. Anyway, fix gear underneath the bridge. I must say, pedal shifters are much easier than manual transmissions, obviously. I see. Let's see if the Toyota has a trick up its sleeve. Ooh. That must have been a clean run because 46.55 is damn good. All right, I don't know what just happened, but somehow, somehow I just beat my record in this car that felt extremely slow. And I screwed up so many times. What is going on? Damn, this is weird. Oh, here's our winner right here, guys. The Toyota. 
<laughs> did they have a trick up its sleeve when I said that? 